In case you didn't know, the sitcom stands for Situation Comedy. I actually, I didn't know that, so I looked this up, but now we know. And it's a genre of television that has been staple of the medium since its earliest days. The origins of the sitcom can be traced back to the early days of radio, where shows like Amos and Andy and the Goldbergs were popular among audiences. These shows were characterized by their focus on situational comedy and re reoccurring casts of characters who were placed in humorous situations. As television became more popular in the 1950s, the sitcom genre quickly made the transition to this new medium. Shows like I Love Lucy and The Honeymooners were some of the first sitcoms to be broadcast on television and they were wildly popular with audiences. These shows were characterized by their use of a multi-camera setup and a live studio audience, which was new at the time, but now modern audiences complain because they often think that it's a laugh track when in fact people are actually laughing at the jokes in these old sitcoms. In the 1960s and 70s, the sitcom genre continued to evolve as shows like The Andy Griffith Show and All in the Family tackled more serious and socially relevant themes. The 70s also saw the rise of the sitcom family as a staple of the genre, with shows like The Brady Bunch and The Partridge Family depicting the lives of families living in suburbia. In the 80s and 90s, the sitcom genre experienced another resurgence in popularity, with shows like Friends and Seinfeld appealing to a new generation of audiences. These shows were known for their relatable characters and comedic writing, and they helped to redefine the sitcom genre for a new generation of viewers. Today, the sitcom genre continues to be a staple of television programming, with shows like The Big Bang Theory and Modern Family drawing large audiences. The sitcom remains a popular genre because of its ability to connect with audiences through relatable characters and comedic circumstances. All in all, the sitcom genre has a long and storied history dating back, as we said, to the early days of radio. Over the years, it has undergone significant changes and has evolved to adapt to changing tastes and preferences of audiences. Today, the sitcom continues to be a popular and enduring genre that connects with audiences through relatable characters and comedic situations. I hope you enjoyed this short video. Now back to your regularly scheduled programming.